currently at Peggy's Cove. We just arrived and you can see the lighthouse in the distance. This area is supposedly haunted, so we'll tell you guys about the scary ghost stories in a little bit. <laughs> yeah. There's always something haunted around in our trip. Haunted by some fishermen. Uh, okay. But we're gonna go check out the rocks and the view, and then we're gonna be having lunch soon, so we'll take you along. One of Nova Scotia's most popular tourist destinations is also one of its most haunted. Peggy's Cove is home to one of the province's most iconic lighthouses. It is also home to the ghost of a woman named Margaret, who settled here after an accident claimed the life of her children. A sign that says, warning, injury and death have rewarded careless sightseers here. The ocean and rocks are treacherous, savor the sea from a distance. That's a good idea. It's a very good idea. <laughs> Margaret spent her days and evenings walking the dangerous rocks of the cove, grieving their loss. One day, in an attempt to cheer her up, Margaret's husband made his way out to the rocks to perform a dance. Tragically, he slipped and fell to his death. Absolutely inconsolable, Margaret jumped into the ocean, taking her own life, but she never really left Peggy's Cove. In fact, to this day, visitors report seeing a distraught woman in a blue dress, standing on the rocks above the ocean. When they get too close, she jumps and disappears. Yep. So we walked all the way down to the water, and it's actually a lot harder than it looks. You can see how big all these rocks are. And there's so many, like, look, there's that. Is he gonna take a photo? I guess oh, so. He's taking a photo. <laughs> Let's take a photo. Okay, we had the photo taken. I was saying there's so many crevices and things in the rock that I'm surprised there's not more accidents. I mean, I guess there, there well, might be. Well, there's warning we signs know about it. quite literally everywhere. Everywhere. Saying stay off any of the darker, more slippery rocks. And here we are. <laughs> I mean, that's down there. We're kind of at the edge. Yeah, it's, it's, you have to be really careful, but this is where we stop. This yeah, is the furthest this is that we beautiful. go. beautiful. I'm still looking for mermaids. <laughs> I want to see one. Well, we're looking for ghosts oh, today. Oh, here comes Dad. This is not the reason why we're here, Jess. Well, for ghosts, not for... I mean... It could be a danger. It could mean more ghosts. <laughs> So we went into a handmade pewter jewelry store and we were looking at the necklaces and I pointed to one that I really liked. And Ty went and bought it for me, which she didn't have to, but it's very sweet. How pretty. And you can see there's like a little stone in the middle. And it's supposed to be like a constellation, so I think it'll match the outfit I'm wearing right now, so I'm gonna put it on. Yeah, so do I want... We're still going on this joke. It's still happening. Something to go along with that little aura of yours. Oh, I, 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 Ty, I saw it in He's there. He's gonna look like a complete pirate. Now. I saw it in there, but I said his shirt's dirty now. He won't be wearing it anymore on this holiday, no, but I next time. Put it on. <laughs> I need the shirt. I need the hat. The now he needs now. the pirate shirt. <laughs> Oi. <laughs> Oi! Wait a minute! I need the hat. Yeah, you need that. I need your shirt. Where's my hot food? <laughs> We've got the lobster bibs happening here. Lobsters mm -hmm. coming shortly. Lobster will be arriving. It matches Mom's blouse. It really does because so, I coordinated. I coordinated. This is very fashionable right now. Wayne's not happy about that. <laughs> and I have hiccups. It's really great. See, I told you they have a vegetarian lobster. A green green one's not a vegetarian, vegetarian lobster. lobster. A green lobster's not vegetarian. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. There it is. Slightly out of focus, but there it is. The lobster. We had the lobster. Steaming and ready. He's trying to figure out how to Dad, tackle this. How do you how do you do it? All right guys, so we have just arrived at Ocean Bay View Luxury Guest House. We're gonna be here for the next two days. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's also a waterfront property. <laughs> and as we speak, someone's playing the flute in the distance and it sounds so pretty. It's so cool because there's like mist over the see, water almost. Gotta, and like someone's playing the flute. Zoom in over there. You can see there's a little bit of smoke over there and I'm pretty confident somebody is having a fire and playing some music. Anyways, I can't wait to show you guys the inside and outside of this house. Let's get going and do a little tour.
Okay, we're at the wooden monkey. It was very difficult to find. <laughs> we almost didn't find it. We almost well, didn't find it. We got lost in we a whole to, different building. We had to climb eight flights of stairs. More door and back. Then go under the misty mountain. And then fight go smoke. through the rainforest. Twirly, twirly gumdrops. Find Gandalf. <laughs> the lollipop forest. Find Gandalf. He did let us pass. He did let us pass, yes. But then go down one level. To Moria. Moria. <laughs> and and we then. couldn't find any and meat And then throw. finally, when we got here, there was no meat throw. Yes. Meat throw. Meat throw. No one's going to understand anything that we're saying right now. But we've got a tree growing out of our table. Yes. With little fairy the lights of, on the it. Tree of Gondor. The tree of, the tree of Gondor. The tree of Gondor. <laughs> right there. If you guys are nerds, you know what I mean. And we got a really nice view out there. It's kind of hard to see with some of the windows, but that is Halifax and over there. And we went over this bridge. Oh, yeah. We did. Yes. Look at that, Jess. Look at it's, uh, it. Smells like Pizza Hut, actually. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of excited about that. Yeah, yeah. I won't say the name. That's a phony. Look at yours. I got that. We won't say the name. Yeah, that looks pretty good. It is. Right. I'm hoping so. Bon appetit. Dang it, Jess, we missed the ferry. How are we getting home now? Jess? I make it aesthetic, Dad. Oh, sorry. Tilted? Oh. Yeah, you'll never be a bartender. That is so much. What are you doing? <laughs> well, we got lots of champagne. After breakfast, we drove to the city of Halifax for some sightseeing. After a long trek up many steep streets, we made it to the historic site on Citadel Hill. Getting to see the large stone walls dug into the earth and exploring the tunnels that twisted through them was awesome to experience. Then we worked our way into the public gardens and thankfully it was a downhill walk. It was such a beautiful day to stroll through and the large band stage at its center was really cool to see. We also met our friend King George along the way. Yeah, that's King George right there. And finally, it was back to the waterfront to Pier 21, which was the same pier my grandfather came in on when he first arrived in Canada with his family when he was a young boy. Getting to experience that with him was really, really special. All right guys, so today we're very sad because we are leaving the Ocean Bayview luxury guest house. It's been absolutely amazing. The views have been beautiful. So we're gonna put all the links down below in the description to their Airbnb listing and to their website. Definitely check it out if you're ever in the area or wanna go on a really nice trip and stay somewhere nice. The hosts have been so welcoming and friendly and generous. So thank you so much for this opportunity. And yeah, we're heading to the airport. Let's go.